Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on Exotic Garden. Now this is a really awesome plugin that adds on to Slime Fun and it adds these awesome trees and bushes that grow various different fruits. So we have some pom pomegranates, cherry, lemon, lime, plums, blueberries, strawberries, coconuts, we have a large coconut tree over here, and many more. And once you harvest these trees you can make various different um, drinks and foods. So if we have a look in the slime fun guide, uh, we will see uh, it has added the plants and fruits section, the drink section, and the food section. So in here it has a list of everything that you can grow. Uh, so we have lots of different bushes and trees and plants. And uh, as you can see, there is two pages of them. There is uh, peaches, I like peaches, um, limes, they're good as well, pears. And uh, what we're going to do is uh, show you how this plugin works. So these will spawn randomly in the wild. For example, the coconut tree will be in a desert biome. Um, and for example, an orange tree will be in a warmer biome. Um, and yeah, so let's go ahead and start by just spawning one in. Uh, so if you have admin powers, you can obviously do this. So we are going to spawn in uh, a peach underscore sapling like that. Uh, there are other ones you can spawn in such as a blueberry bush, I believe. Blueberry underscore bush like that. So uh, that's how you spawn them in if you want to cheat or test it out. Uh, but they will spawn in the wild. So let's use some bone meal and this is our peach tree. Looks very nice. So we can harvest these fruits and actually make something very, very delicious. So let's take a few down and what's this? So right click the bushes once they've grown. Uh, these are grapes, grape bushes or grape vines. Uh, we have some pineapples here, uh, which is cool. So harvest those. We have some blueberries on the end. And let's grab a few coconuts as well. Why not? So coconut trees, yay. There we go. So. Uh, a lumber axe in Slime Fun uh, can be used to cut down the tree instantly, so that is a very useful feature. There it is in action, as you can see the whole tree fell down and the rest will just decompose in time. So once you've collected your various fruits, you can make them into juices or into something nice to eat. So if we go back into the guide and go into drinks, let's have a look at that to begin with. Uh, you can see there are a lot and they are very easy to create. You need a juicer to create drinks and you need an advanced crafting bench to create uh, various foods. So how do we create this? Well it's very straightforward. You pop a crafting table on top of, the, of a dispenser for the advanced crafting table and the juicer is a glass followed by a nether brick fence and a dispenser facing upwards. That's very important or it will not work. So once you've done that, I'll just quickly show you, uh, pop that down facing upwards and then just pop this on by shift right clicking and then uh, pop this on the top like that, very straightforward. And once you've done that, right click the bottom dispenser, pop in whatever fruit you want, so let's go with maybe blueberry, pop that in, exit out, right click the nether brick fence in the middle and then right click the bottom again to get your juice out and that will taste very very nice. So once you've done that you can um, create it again and you might be able to make some form of food with it. So if we have a look at the food, uh, exotic garden food, you will see there are a lot here. There are salads, there are soups, there are pies, there are sandwiches and there are cheesecakes and much much more popcorn as well. Uh, so if you click on like, each of these they will show you a various different recipe uh, so what do we need for this uh, sandwich? So we need two slices of bread and some blueberry juice. So that's what we have. So we can create that one. And we could even create a strawberry salad if we had some strawberries. Uh, but what else can we create? An egg salad. Uh, some mayo. <laughs> that's pretty awesome that you can get that. And a grape salad. So yeah, let's, let's make those two. We need to put the juice in, not the, uh, not the fruit. Right click the top. And there we go, we have our jelly sandwich, uh, which is awesome. So blueberry jam if you're from the UK, or blueberry jelly if you're from the States. So let's go ahead and create that salad using the grapes. Uh, let me just see, I need a bowl. Let's grab that here, pop it in the bottom with the grape. 
and right click and it should turn into a grape salad and they, they each restore a different amount of hunger uh, but obviously we're in creative so we cannot eat that. So that is the plugin, it's really awesome, it has so many different trees, bushes and plants that uh, players will never go hungry again, especially when they're eating all this exotic fruit. Uh, it's free to download as I said and it's a great addition to your server and to slime fun so check it out below and subscribe, like, comment and I'll see you next time.